What you're looking at right now is the 3 liter 4 cylinder engine that pushes 140 kilowatts with 450 newton meters of torque. Ladies and gentlemen, today we focus on Nogwaja. If you love Bucky's and you've been on TikTok for more than a year, I'm sure you've heard. Ow, 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 ow. Nogwaja. Sigu Pilan. Hehehe. Nogwaja. So this is the vehicle that they will be referring to. You can see the front end guys, absolutely stunning. So this is a 2024 Isuzu DMX 3 liter DDI V-Cross. This is the 4x4 variant top of the range guys. So you can see there on the side V-Cross. So cash price on this particular vehicle is 860,000 rands. So yeah, if you've got that kind of money, you can go and uh, buy this particular vehicle. So today we're just having a closer look at uh, what is Nogwaja all about. So you can see this side, it has got those uh, black handles. I'm not really a big fan, but just because it's Nogwaja, they, they, they look nice. And then you can see you've got that uh, side step as well, uh, just to help uh, some of you who are vertically challenged to get into the vehicle. And then I really like uh, these 18 inch alloy wheels and those all terrain tires so meaning that uh, you can go wherever and uh, yeah it is a uh, quite a good bucky though on the figures i'm a little bit disappointed because there are buckies out there that are pushing like whoa, 160 or 170 kilowatts and as much as 500 or even 600 newton meters of torque so yeah maybe that's the reason why this uh, price is a little bit low because if you compare it with your toyotas uh, they fetching over a million and then the back side you can see it has got a toy each which is a good thing and then at the bottom that's where your spare wheel is you've got a couple of sensors as well at the back and then that is your base camera uh, obviously if you are reversing the vehicle and then to open uh that you simply do like that and then good thing this one it has got a roller shutter and uh, it is quite easy to operate uh, so what you can do is you can lift um, up there just uh, to release it and then it will slide all the way in and then to pull it back you simply pull it from there so uh, for me it was a little bit uh, difficult guys for me to lock this because I'm recording and trying to pull it at the same time as I close this load bed let's talk about economy so this particular vehicle it comes with a 76 uh, liter fuel tank capacity and that will give you a range of around uh, 938 uh, kilometers uh, that is if you are driving it normally and on average you should be able to do um, 8.1 liters for every 100 kilometers so yeah i think it is quite okay for such a big Bucky, and then you can see the spare wheel uh, once again uh, a much clearer shot and then you can see there 4x4 I really like at uh, the back side the overall look of this particular vehicle guys it is uh, marvelous and uh, on that uh, note if you were to finance uh, this particular one because I know a lot of us we won't afford to fork out that uh, 860,000 rands so if let's say maybe you pay a deposit of 10% uh, uh, you should be looking uh, maybe at paying uh, somewhere around 15,800 uh, each and every month for a period of um, 72 months. That is if, if you get uh, the actual prime uh, lending rate, which is 13.75%. Uh, uh, so yeah, guys, uh, it is uh, quite um, expensive as well, but not as much as your Ford Rangers or your Toyotas. And then that is uh, the top of the vehicle. And then checking out at uh, this side as well, everything really does look cool. Now let's jump Pagati inside. You can see uh, your door panel, it is very neat. Uh, you can put uh, your water bottle there and respect this vehicle don't be putting a black label up uh, and then you've got a bunch of controls on that um, armrest uh, on that window rather uh, you can open and uh, close your windows and adjust your mirrors as well down there you've got your pedals your brake and your accelerator and uh, there that's where you open your fuel cap from and then your bonnet from there quite easy guys and then you can see a bunch of controls this side there is your air vent obviously you need that fresh air if you are going to be driving this particular vehicle and then look at those lovely seats quite comfortable guys so if you've been having doubts about buckies 
this is one of the most comfortable party out there and then you can see your seats you can adjust them in different ways if you want to sit sort of like a, a polo driver you can so long do so but i wouldn't recommend uh, that because on this one you sit in a commanding position and then you've got uh, a seat belt as well because yeah safety comes uh, first guys and it is uh, obviously important and then we're just gonna jump into the car you can see there's a handle there that will help you to get into the vehicle uh, easily then uh, that is your uh, obviously your steering wheel at the center you've got your hooter on this side you've got a bunch of controls you can activate your voice controls and then you can increase or decrease your volume you can seek in between songs and then you can answer or up your phone as well so which is a good thing and then this side you can set uh, your cruise control uh, there uh, which is a good thing and then uh, so yeah if you are interested in this particular uh, vehicle guys I urge you can go and check it out if you are in Nelspreet you can go and see Andandwe Mkachwa he is the sales uh, guy there by Isuzu he will definitely uh, give you a good deal and then this side that's where you control your lighting of the vehicle obviously you can increase the intensity and then your indicators as well and then on the other side that's where you adjust your wipers if it is raining and all that and then that is your instrument cluster once again your rev counter and then on the other side is your speedometer you can see it goes all the way to 220 but yeah guys don't be driving uh we'll go 220 and then there some extra storage space so hi uno kwacha is loaded in mpela bafetu and then you can see uh, that is your infotainment screen it's a nine uh, inch and then you can see everything really does uh, check out you've got an automatic uh, gearbox remember so this is a six speed if i'm not mistaken and then this side you've got a bunch of controls for obviously you're locking your diff and all that that is your handbrake your cup holders your armrest if you are going to be doing those long distances because in most cases uh, normally people will drive uh, these buckies like for long distances and all that this side you've got your glove compartment you can lock it and then there are your, some of your documents and then some more storage space as well you can put in your phones there and then overall i think the interior of this particular vehicle it is very nice now you get a sun visor for who made them or your friend or whoever that will be sitting there it has got a mirror obviously for them to put makeup and all that your lighting for the vehicle if it's at night if you've got sunglasses you can put them in there don't hide your money in there otherwise you will forget and then this side obviously just uh like the same with the driver side everything looks uh, proper you can see that's where you open your door from i'm just gonna close that uh, quite nicely and then uh, also your window you can open it from there that is the roof of the vehicle everything really does uh, check out this side you've got a, a power socket so yeah uh, if you want to charge uh, your phones the old school way you can do so and then you've got your usb there and also an oxy input there and then you've got your four low and your four high so for those of you who are into off-roading this vehicle is quite capable and i'm sure that you've seen uno kwaja on tiktok uh, the way uh, he is showing other car brands especially the back is some flames there and then you can see this side um everything really does uh, look okay um you've got uh, your water bottle contain a holder there and then you've got your speakers everything it is a uh, top quality with this uh, particular vehicle so yeah guys if you've test driven this particular car or if you own this car let us know of your ownership uh, experience and uh, you can see uh, it is quite loaded and also passengers at the back if they've got their own air vents and then they can also charge there you can see your usb there and then that is me obviously struggling to open it so yeah guys uh, while we are on that uh, subject we're just gonna talk about uh, the warranty that uh, this particular vehicle comes with so it has got a service plan which is five years for 90 kilo uh, 90,000 kilometers and then the service intervals are obviously 15,000 or 12 months and then you also get warranty and roadside assistance five years 120,000 kilometers and then there is also an anti-corrosion warranty for five years with unlimited kilometers so yeah you're getting more than a vehicle here guys and then checking out at this side you can see you can hide uh, your baby some stuff there or you can put whatever it may be a jack or some other things and then you can open that quite easily and then uh yeah i really like uh, the way that it folds and then you can see it also has got uh, the headrest as the back and then uh yeah checking out at uh, this side you've got some handles as well 
overall i think this is a marvelous vehicle guys let me know what you think about this and then you can see the light there you can light that quite easily 